it dawned on me that this was the very first time uh, a non-organic intelligence was able to plan, design, and execute these complex chemical reactions. In December of 2023, we published a paper in Nature called the Autonomous Chemical Researchers Large Language Models. Uh, it all started with our interest in being able to run experiments in a high throughput fashion without breaking the bank. I was starting as an assistant professor, I simply did not have enough funds to purchase machines that were multiple times more expensive than OT2. But another part of this was frustration that I had uh, previously with hardware that simply did not allow the user to control closer to the hardware level. OpenTrans offered all of that from the get-go with the idea of uh, open hardware and open software. This, this naturally uh, then grew into the idea of uh, partnering with OpenTrans when we developed a co-scientist that now can write protocols and code to run the experiment. Automation will uh, free up our minds to think more. Can we have a system that will be allowing us to discover new transformations and new materials uh, that will help in mitigating uh, the worst of climate uh, catastrophe, that will allow for us to have better energy sources, that will allow for us to clean our water and air uh, from pollutants. And that will allow for us to live longer and, and healthier lives.